Hello, welcome to English for Everyone, where we practice real-life American English. Today we're going to learn to sound more natural by choosing the correct vocabulary, so let's get started. We have these three adjectives that mean the same thing, but two of them are not common and one of them is. Which one is it? We have courageous, valiant, and brave. They're all correct words, but the one we use is brave. Brave is the most common in conversational English. So avoid using courageous and valiant. Use the word brave to describe someone. It's an adjective. Example, the fireman. The fireman is very brave. You have to be brave to do that job. I love that. I love that. He's brave and I'm, what, nothing? Look, I don't know if he's brave or stupid. He's brave and sneaky and strong. And when the man who is brave and true looks death squarely in the face like some rhino hunters I know or Belmonte who's truly brave. And then we have these three words. These three words are nouns. We have courage, valor, and bravery. They're all correct and they all mean the same thing. And they're all nouns. So which one do we use? Which is the most common? Avoid using bravery and valor. The most common word is courage. Pronunciation, courage. Use the er sound like burger, cur, cur, and the short sound, idge, idge. Courage, courage. You faced a terrible darkness and you had the courage to ask for help. You have the courage to check and see if there are enough sanitary napkins in the dispenser? You know, there's a real problem at this school and no one has the courage to talk about it. But you didn't have the courage to stand by what you knew to be true. Example, he's a fireman. You need a lot of courage to do that job. It's a noun, so you need to have a lot of courage to do that job. That job requires a lot of courage. Let's practice. Is he brave? That's right, he's brave. Do you need to be brave to run in a burning house? That's right, you need to be brave to run in a burning house. Do you need a lot of courage to do this job? That's right, you need a lot of courage to do this job. Does this job require a lot of courage? That's right, this job requires a lot of courage. So remember, of all these words, we only need to use two to sound more natural when speaking. If you want an adjective, use brave. If you want the noun form, use courage. Thank you for watching, and if you like this video, subscribe to our channel. And if you click the join button below, you can become a member and I can answer any question you have or make a video just for you. Thanks for watching.